This is where it will begin. A new uprising. You're one of us now, you see? I was actually going to ask you about that, King Madanak. I am from the Blind Cliff Coven, but Petra betrayed us. It's only the two of us left out of the tower, and, well, Melka has experimented with one too many plants, I think. I should have expected as much. Such a shame. Did you know something about that? No. However, I know someone who might. Oh, you don't mean... The Crag Hermit. The one who lives by that Nordic ruin. Yes, I'm afraid you're right. Oh, good. Hopefully she's accepting visitors. Maybe she'll know who Petra aligned herself with. My grandaunt did not act alone. She had enough warriors to take the tower and the cave, both, and trapped Melka in a cage. Hmm. This is intriguing, but highly disturbing. That's what I thought too. And there aren't that many places on this side of the Reach where one could hide that many people. And one of them had this with her. The Legend of Red Eagle. I see. There's only one place that could be. The only place that makes sense to me is the Sundered Towers. It's nearby and has those tunnels up through the hill. That is correct. Well, my only question now is why? Which the Hermit probably knows, and I suspect it has something to do with Red Eagle given the book. You speak truly. Interesting, to say the least. What with all that's been going on. What do you mean? You see, I've lost something precious. Because of you. Oh, uh... What? Wait. Nepos? Yes. I've spent a long time building up a list of contacts. And you want me to help get them back? That's the least I can do. I promise I did try to tell him I was one of us, but... I suppose at the time I wasn't. Not technically. Not of the Druidach clan, anyway. And with all of the infighting... I guess I can hardly blame him. Right, what do I have to do? Get out there. See what you come up with. That's it? That's all I ask. I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. <laughs> right. I am glad you have such faith in me, Madanach. I'll see what I can do. And... Maybe the Hermit will give me more of an idea. Then I think we're done talking. Uh, of course. Right. Right. How do I fill in for Nepos? Right. There's Ragenvold. There's that thing. Probably some sort of warning about danger would be my guess. Which is fair. We'll see if the... We'll see if the Hermit is actually in today. And accepting... Visitors. It can sort of be... A question whether or not she's actually around. not really like anyone in the reach to stay in one spot for long periods of time anyway. Which reminds me I need to go at some point see what's going on over at Sunder Towers. Not today. Maybe today. I have to figure out what I'm going to do about the Nepos thing. After we see 
If our friendly crag hermit is actually home. Don't really want to disturb her. Also don't really want to approach with my bow drawn. That seems... Is she home? Yes, she is. There she is. Excuse me, we know this lady. Excuse me. Oh, God. Right, and of course we have a blizzard coming through. Excuse me. I don't mean to disturb, but... I am Enna, from the Blind Cliff Coven. You know Melka, right? Mm, Melka. Melka, yes. Makes good poisons. Yes, yes. Melka, with the poisons. Fearful meat. What brings you to my home? Well... Our home was attacked. Petra betrayed us. I'm trying to figure out who did it, and Maranach told me... Maranach. I broke him out of Sydney Mine, but it's not important. Maranach. Arrogant child. He is, a bit. I, I think perhaps he's coming around, though. He told me to come see you, because you might know uh, why Petra betrayed us. What she was planning. Why... Too many questions, child. One at a time. You'll help us then? Or, well, me? Just speak. Not help. Right, that's what I meant. I realize you don't really like people. Noisy. Yes, very, very noisy. So, we think, I think, that... Petra aligned herself with the Briarheart to Sunder Towers, and that's why they attacked us. Trying to control the valley, maybe. Clever meat. So, assuming that's true, which it might not be, but that's the only thing I can think of. And why? What's he planning? He didn't calm down himself. Ah, yes. War. War? With... All the clans of the rich. Yes. As Melka told her clever child. Told me what? <sighs> Not so clever, Melka. Told me what? What is it? Red Eagle awakens. You have sensed it too, yes? Stirrings of battle. Restless rocks. The very stones quake. Change comes. I have been feeling restless. Do you think the Briarheart is taking orders from him? You're supposed to be taking care of his tomb, but... No. Listen close. Your bones fill with rage. The roots of the land protect you, and you would protect them, too. Speak. Yes, I would. I want to protect this land with all that I am. I want peace for us. All of us. I don't want war, but if that's what it takes. Walk the path of Hestra. Fly on eagle's wings. In red... You wake the saber. In black, you bind the king. I don't know what any of that means. You will, clever meat. That's... That's it? Only speak, not help. Thank you, I think. One last thing. Any idea how I'd fill in for Madanok's right-hand man in Markarth? Ah, uh, right. Thank you for your time, and your, uh, and the prophecy thing. 
Right. Note to self. Don't ask Hagravens unnecessary questions. You would think I'd know that by now, but... Here we are. God, it's hard to see. But I think Markarth is in that direction. And that is, I think, the way that I need to go. Oh dear. Yeah. That hurt. Right. Okay. There, just in case. And now, of course, the sun comes back out again. Right, it's still cold though, so I'm going to keep my hood up for the moment. Let's go up this way. There's that strange temple that the Karth Spire clan guards. Right. So... I don't have any idea what any of that meant. Oh, and that will be Markarth there, which is good because... I think that's going to be how we have to... start trying to fill in for Nebos. What did he do? What was his whole thing about... I still have his- I do. Right, and he did not leave much here. Rack the brain, what did he- What did he get up to? Right, I need to make myself look as unlike a forsworn as I can, in spite of the fact that my tattoos make me rather obvious. No, we're coming in off the road, don't mind us. I should potentially keep my hood up. That way I don't get recognized for my hair. Nepos, Nepos. With the nose. What he was up to. <laughs> Who knows? Hmm. Uh, who is this? Somebody I do not want to mess with. really want to talk to anybody. Least of all the guards. I also don't want to walk in the front door, but here we go. Oh, and now it's raining. That does figure, doesn't it? Right. The bloodiest beef in the reach. Ah, ah. Not your beef, Crook. Right. Do you want to go hang out with the other ravens, crows, whatever, so that you don't go bothering that man at his stand? Ah. Alright. 
You can make it up over that. Go be a little scavenger crook. We'll see if you find me any shinies. And away he goes. Right, where do I start? When in doubt, start in the tavern. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Right. Do you have any... Uh... Would you mind if I read that? Citizens of Markarth, how long will you allow your kinsmen in the Warrens to suffer? They are the backs upon which this city is built and they have been forgotten. No more. You can help with a few coins. Uh, a few coins will feed a hungry mouth. Lumber, cloth, medicine. We can use anything you can spare. Travelers willing to pick up donations in Rift and in Solitude would be greatly appreciated. Pre Please direct questions to Aleth. Good to know. I will keep that in mind. No, then. How are your chores coming, my son? Today I've cleaned the linens, washed the floors, and checked in on all our guests. Ah, my son. You'll be a fine innkeeper someday. Like your father. But mother says you're a terrible innkeeper. Never mind your mother, Ren. You listen to me and you'll be a great man one day. Not with that attitude. I suppose that would depend on how one calls a great man. Or defines them, I suppose. I wonder who that was. Right. So the Warrens? I wonder what Nepos did around here. Uh, excuse me. I saw you with the Forsworn. By the old gods, that was something. Right, so I'm recognizable then. Great, good to know. Uh. You escaped Sid the Mine with Madanak? Everyone in the Warrens has been praising your name. You know, that's. It's a good lead, thank you, I think. So that. Gives me somewhat of a leg up, I think. Probably. I hope. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? Uh, that depends. Are you Aleth? Good afternoon. You have. You have tattoos. Are you the one who posted the Warren's flyer? I mean, you're... are you Aleth? Yes. Right. Um... I'm... here for Madanak. What's next on your to-do list? Because I can probably go do that. You will? Thank you. Good day. Right. Thanks. Er, uh, you're welcome. Hey. Hey, think. I've got some old tools you can have, too rusted to be much use for anything else. I'll leave them outside the mine. Pick them up soon, they're blocking the walkway. Right. Which walkway? Because... I seem to remember... The walkway... Way up here, where we came out of- oh good, there's still a light. That's- that's excellent. I seem to remember coming out of some sort of thing up through one of these places somewhere. This is rather a difficult city to navigate. Right. Uh, they must have locked it up again. Come on. 
come on. Oh, wait. Come on, I only have one left. expected to end up. Um... Where am I? I guess we'll just see where this comes back out, won't we? Now that it's unlocked, it'll be a good back entrance to wherever it ends up. I think. Probably. Oh, great. That's a problem. I suppose I could just come out the other way, but I want to know what's in there. Or where it comes out, rather. This is unfortunate. This one's empty. That'll do. Thank you. Random... whatever that was. If there's someone on the other side of this thing, I'm going to be... probably in a lot of trouble, but... Come on. Oh. I was here the whole time. Uh, ex Hi, hello. Um, I seem to be a bit lost. If it's about the Hall of the Dead, no, you can't go in there. Uh, what's the Hall of the Dead? Hmm. <laughs> New to Skyrim? I was confused at first, too. The Nords call their mausoleums the Hall of the Dead. It's where people in the city are buried. Fathers, forefathers, mothers, foremothers. Right, and... Forgive me for asking, but why can't we go in there? I can't talk about it. Rest assured, the Jarl hears everyone's concerns. You will be able to visit the dead again soon. Eh, uh, right. Uh... Maybe I could help. Alright. I was going to suggest the Jarl hire someone to sort this mess out anyway. We've discovered that some of the dead have been... eaten. Flesh has been chewed off. Bones were snapped to get at the marrow inside. We haven't caught anyone or anything yet. It's like it knows when I'm there. If you can get to the bottom of this, the priesthood of Arke will reward you. Take my key, and be careful. Uh... Right. Uh... Question, which one's R.K.? R.K. One of the Eight Divines. God of the Cycle of Birth and Death. 
It is his shrine people pray to when they visit the hall. That his divinity will watch over their ancestors on the way to the next life. Right. Uh, I'll just go take care of the... Tread lightly in the hall. You don't know what's in there. Uh... Not a whole lot, actually. It didn't seem like there was a whole lot in here, would not I? Not many would walk blindly into a crypt, smelling of steel and blood, but not fear. Uh... I feel the hunger inside of you, gnawing at you. You see the dead, and your mouth grows wet. Your stomach growls. Uh... not... really? It's all right. I will not shun you for what you are. Stay. I will tell you everything you have forgotten. Right. I don't know who you think I am. You were young when you first tasted human flesh, weren't you? A brother or sister had died? An accident, of course. Then the hunger set in. Curiosity. What's the harm in just one bite? It's okay now. You found a friend who understands you. You can let go of your guilt. Ah! Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't... eat people? I mean, granted I use human flesh and hearts for poisons, but I don't... eat them. <laughs> Raw. Anyway? What are you talking about? A lot of our kind block out the memory of their first meal. The shame is too much. But you don't need to hide anymore. Namira, the Lady of Decay, accepts you for what you are. She has a place for us where we can sate our appetites without judgment. I... I don't think you understand Namira the way I do. Alright, I'll humor you. Where is this place that you're talking about? It's inside Reachcliff Cave. But the dead have stirred from their slumber recently, and I was forced here. Meet me there. We all fight our way to Namira's embrace together. Until then, tell the people of Markarth that their dead won't be disturbed anymore. We have bigger plans ahead. I can still hear you. Great. Just great. Well, that was... You've returned. What happened in the Hall of the Dead? Oh, not much. There's nothing in there as far as I could tell. Divines preserve you. You're a hero. We'll reopen the Hall right away. Here, take my amulet as a reward. Right. Uh... Good talking with you. Okay, protect you. And... Uh, something. Right. What do people say? Uh, RK protect you too. That's what people say. People don't go around invoking Crokey Bag for that kind of thing. I. I'm not sure where people got this idea about Namira just being the Lady of Decay. Hmm. Who knows? I do, however, find it interesting that the Nords have a God of Death. Also, the... There's no toolbox around here somewhere. Or anywhere, rather. Which means, it must be over there. Where I should have lurked... Looked... First. Right. And then I'll go deal with... Whatever that is. But right, the Nords have a god of death. We have a goddess of death. And her name is Namira. You lost. Uh, I hope not. 
You work fast. What? Uh Um <laughs> Sorry. I I don't mean to be insensitive, but Yes. What are you? Tidying. Need something? Nope, no, I'm I What is that? Uh right. Alice. Yes. I found the toolbox. Eventually, got a bit of distracted. Thank you. I'll be sure to put it to good use. Right. Uh, you work fast. Uh, what else needs to be done? So much. Maybe you can help me. It's all in this note. I can certainly try. Skiva repellent. Right, what have we got here? Ten linen wraps for blankets, twenty firewood, healing herbs from an You could be more specific. Angeline's aromatics in solitude. Great. Donated shrine of Mara from the Temple in Riften. And pick up shipment of vegetables from Salvius Farm. Great. I don't know where it Two of those places are. I know where Solitude is. Ah. Uh, I don't know what that is. Hi, sorry. I've obviously not been out of the tower enough. Uh, I'm just going to go to the farm, one of the farms, and take care of. Whatever the walking dead problem is, with whatever her name is. Salvia's farm. Well, I hope it's not raining. I hope it's that one. I think it's that one. And then, how far away is Reachcliff Cave? All the way down the road. That's fine. I wonder where Crook went off to. Oh, I got out of the shadow of the mountain and uh, the light just changed. Or out of the shadow of Markarth, one of the two. It does rather cast a long shadow. Uh, right, and who do I need to find? doesn't say. That's helpful. Probably not from the dog would be my guess. Right. Excuse me. Kolskegger, overrun with Forsworn. What next? Well. Uh. Rest of the reach, probably. Excuse me? Damn Forsworn. Only a matter of time before they hit here, too. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm looking for... Poor Pavo and Gat. To have lived through a Forsworn attack. I'm looking for someone to trade for vegetables. Is there anyone around? Maybe it's whoever works over there. Excuse me, I don't want to trample your chicken. My boy Leontius lives in Old Trolden. Damn drunk. 
What? That's right. Old Inn to the south. The Oaf doesn't even bother to visit these days. What am I supposed to do if the dragons burn down the farm? You're a traveler, right? I have this letter for him. Let him know how much of a failure he is. Uh... Okay. What's this about dragons? Good. You make sure the lug tips you when he gets it. Alright. Thanks. Mm -hmm. What? What? What have I just saved myself up for? And where is the other man who is just out here working? Not him. Oh, I've lived. Next thing you know, there'll be some kind of damn blight and undead will walk the land. Oh, what is this? A visitor to our farm? Oh, do stay for a while, dear. Maybe we could invite some of those nice guards over. You know, for some supper. No, I have enough trouble without more mouths to feed. They're the Jarl's men. They can eat supper at the keep. Now don't you let Rogatus cause you any bother. Right, thanks. Someone is looking for Skeever repellent, and I don't know who, and I did not expect it to be this much of a chore. You know, little oak spirit, you don't need to protect me just from running past a stronghold. The orcs mean me no harm. Oh, but the wolves might. One never knows. Thank you for keeping- and away she goes. I was going to thank her for keeping me warm in the blizzard earlier and I sort of missed it. That's fine. Right. Reach Cliff Cave. Reach Cliff Cave is around here somewhere. I think it's up here. Right, there you are. You've come. The Draugr infesting the Mirror Sanctuary are inside. Alright. Are you going to help, or are you going to wait here? I was hoping you would say that. Alright, we are doing this together then. Actually, I'm going to do this. Draugr, right? Well, in that case, it's not worth... Wasting poison on. We'll just do this stealthily. Right. Crook. You be a scavenger. Somewhere else. Huh? Well, you'll have to be quiet and let me do my work. Draugr are below. Foul tasting. Have you tried? Have you tried to eat Draugr? What's wrong with you? Oh, they're tough. Great. That's delightful. Right, so that's not going to work. Uh, so none of that will work. Right, we'll just keep it on healing and hope for the best.
Come on, Oak Spirits, do your job. Great. This is going to be interesting, isn't it? I might come through and loot them later. Indeed she does. Nice. That'll come in handy. Actually, hang on. I'm not sure if I can actually do this, but... Aha! <laughs> nice. Melka would be proud, I think. Or Petra would. Idea what's going on anymore? Great. Namira, grind your bones for my bread. Oh boy! All right, we're going down this way. Oh, hello. Right, I'll distract him. You finish him. Nice. And that's how we do that. This is actually quite fun. Walking around with dead Nords, doing my bidding. It's not how I expected my day to go, but I'm not going to complain. Well, it was anticlimactic. Heavy looking boots. Don't know what those do, but I'm going to take them anyway, and I'll analyze them later. Oh. Well. What was- oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. Hey, Lola. Help. That would be nice. Please do. Right, just keep him in line with her fireballs. Get him. 
You've done it. The shrine is ours again. Now we need to prepare a grand feast to welcome you to Namira's coven. You will have the honor of bringing a fresh kill for the main course, and I know the perfect person. Uh... Who? A priest filled with the taste of an easy life, Brother Verilis from Markarth. Give him this gold. Tell him you need Arke's help exploring an old cavern for treasure. And when he stands in Amira's presence, she will take care of the rest. Great. Say hello to Verilis for me. Nice. Taking that as a trophy. That was a lot. I hate fighting undead. Many used to come to these caves. The forgotten, the wretched. The uh the forsworn? <laughs> Just saying. I'm not sure how the Goddess of Rebirth would be. Uh, I mean, I suppose. One tends to use the dead for things like poisons and whatnot to give them a new life in some kind of way. Sort of. Right, let's go find Verilis. Right, here we are. This is the tomb that I need help clearing. Shall we? Don't worry. RK's protection is absolute. Right. So I should not worry about Draugr or anything else like that then. not expect a whole party. Well, this is unexpected. Um... Who are you? What's going on? Priest of RK. I'm your friend. You're my... friend? Yes, I'm your friend, and I've invited you to dinner. I've been invited to dinner. I'm so hungry. Why don't you lay down and rest while we get the meal ready? I need to lay down. I'll just be a minute. Come with me. Our feast is about to begin. How did you do that, exactly? That's, uh... Did not expect that. You know, this looks suspiciously like a ritual. Hold on. And one last thing. There. No, I'm ready. The meal is on Namira's table. Go ahead, carve. Taking that. I don't know about those, though. Right. Uh, I've never been good at incantations. Namira? Uh, Spirit Queen, Goddess of Death, Darkness, Endings, Rebirth, Ruler of the Spirit World, we give to you this offering. He looks so sweet. Go ahead, have the first bite. Ah. Uh, as long as I can use it for a potion later. Just saying.
Mortal. I am Namira, the Lady of Decay. Your consumption of the blood and bile of Arcae's own is pleasing to me. What? I give you my ring. Wear it, and when you feast on the flesh of the dead, I will grant you my power. I humbly thank you, uh, Queen of Spirits. Wallow in your wretchedness, my newest champion. I knew when you walked into the Hall of the Dead that you were special. I don't know about special, but I'm certainly something. Well... This certainly... Is something? Hello, I will be taking you. Melka likes stabs. Right, uh, have a good meal. On that note, I'm going to be on my way. Is she following me? I hope not. Um, right. I knew when you walked into the hall. And here you are, champion of Namira, keeper of her ring. You're everything I hoped you'd be. Uh, thank you, I think. It's an honor, champion. Feel free to stay and mingle with your new coven. I actually have some business to do, but, uh... Go ahead, eat. Oh, I'm good. Namira covets your ugliness. Right. I'm just going to be on my way. Not too full on bread and wine. I always leave room for the main course. <laughs> I hope that Namira doesn't mind me using um things as potions instead of just eating them. Just be a waste if you ask me. Anyway. Right. Crook? Ah, ah. Um. I have a new source of food for you. Ah. Uh. You know, corpses. And we are going to head to... Solitude, I suppose. Probably by way of the swamp. Because... I need to go up that way anyway and restock some potion ingredients and... Uh... Then we need to go into a city. I don't like that very much. But off we go.